Have you ever wondered why a black box that is flight data and cockpit voice recorder is called a black box even though it isn't black? Instead, it is actually painted bright red orange. Dr. David Warren, an Australian, lost his father when he was a child due to a plane crash in 1934. So when he grew up, he had an idea for a unit that could record flight data and cockpit conversations to help find out what happens moment before the accident of an aeroplane. This gave birth to what we call the black box today. Though it wasn't famous initially, it gained popularity when USA and UK started manufacturing them. Today, the flight data recorder can record more than 88 parameters of a plane for 24 hours and the cockpit voice recorder records the conversation of the cockpit for 2 hours. This information is stored on a solid state drive. They are made very strong that it is virtually indestructible. They can withstand 3400 Gs, 1100 Celsius fire and any other atrocious condition. They have helped the analyst to identify the cause of accidents for many aircrafts. The origin of the term black box is uncertain, but here are few explanations. Number 1. In 1960s, system engineers used the term black box for a device where they knew its inputs and outputs without any knowledge of its internal working. So the pilots who knew nothing about the implementation of FDR and CVR used the term black box. Number 2. Initially the data was stored on light sensitive films like a photograph which required the inside of the recorder to be perfectly dark to prevent light leaks from corrupting the record as in photographer's dark room. So the term black box. Number 3. Prior to the end of the World War II, new electronics which were added to the bombers and aircrafts were covered in handmade metal boxes, painted black to prevent reflections. So the flight data recorder and the cockpit voice recorder also became a black box when they were added to these planes. Number 4. In one of David Warren's explanation about his invention, a journalist afterwards told him that it was a wonderful black box, so the term black box. This term has been popularized by media and is almost never used within the flight safety industry or aviation. Finally, keeping aside the controversy of its nomenclature, the black box, oh, sorry, but I feel this word is easier and attractive to use, has been instrumental in helping the aviation industry learn from the mistakes and strive and work for a safer and wonderful tomorrow. That's it. Hope you guys learned something new from it. Thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe for more enriching videos in future. Thanks for watching. It's your Guru signing off. See you guys in the next one.